My friends, how are we all doing today? It is your buddy Keith. We're here live in the control room at Essex Recording Studios, just outside London in England. And I've got a very, very special, very different Ibanez Prestige RG Series guitar to share with you today. This thing is killer. If you're new to the channel, click subscribe, click like. You're going to get to see some real cool up-close videos of guitars where we talk about all the features, all the cool things that make them unique, and uh, yeah, totally free. Can't beat it. Click subscribe, click like, come join the circle of friends, and we will be having a lot of good times on this channel. Now, about this guitar. So this is, let's go ahead and open up the case here. I have two inspection cards. This is an RG1820X in Galaxy Black. You can see it was made in 2007, January 17th, 2007. If we flip this over, whoop, just lost it there. You can see it's made by Team J Craft. Best of the best on the case as well. Loving these Ibanez cases. Look, even has the Prestige logo built into it. Awesome cases. Real plush, real nice. Have all the storage you need. Um, real thoughtful. You can just pick up the guitar from here. Super snug. It's great. So, you might see a lot of bells and whistles on this guitar. You're going, holy smokes, Keith, what is up with all of the knobs and this little guy right here? What does this guy do? Well, what makes this guitar special is in the bridge is an LR Bags Piezo pickup for acoustic type sounds. Now, that's killer. I hope I'm saying Piezo right or Piezo, Piezo, I don't know. You let me know how you guys say it. I say Piezo. Um, with LR bags, that, that style pickup, that, that's kind of like what you find in the most expensive custom shop Gibsons. And this model, the 18, what did we say it was? What was it? The RG1820X replaced the RG1620X. And what this one got is this extra tone knob up top for the Piezo pickup. So this thing has a wealth of tonal possibilities. If you don't like the Ibanez pickups, throw them out and throw in uh, whatever you like. Some De DiMarzios or some EMGs, some Duncans, some bare knuckles. Go nuts, guys. But no matter what, built in here, you're going to have that killer piezo. I'm a big fan of Galaxy Black. I think it looks really cool. I think it looks cool in stage lighting. Kind of looks like outer space. I'm getting some love on Facebook. Thanks. All right. Um, you have the small dot inlays. Smaller than what you typically find. Are they mirror? Can't really tell. They're kind of reflective. We'll call them reflective. The frets have like nowhere. This thing doesn't look like it's been played much. And you know that because wait till you see the back. There's like nowhere on it. It's got the Mother of Pearl Ibanez logo. Prestige. Take it out. Flip her around. Love, love, love the neck on this guitar. But let's look at the back. Notice how there's like no buckle scratches on any of the plastics really. It's like real minor. Just maybe some rub marks and stuff like that. That shows you that this thing hasn't been played that much. And like look at the, look at the tips. Yeah, you're going to find a couple marks on this guitar, but you can tell this definitely has not been gigged. Absolutely beautiful. My favorite part on these are the necks. These wizard necks are just to die for. They're so nice. They're so flat and thin, ergonomic, and you can really shred on them. Again, there's a reason why John Petrucci and Steve Vai and, you know, uh, Joe Satriani, why the masters are all running around using Ibanez's. They are built to shred. Team J-Craft, F Fuji Gen serial number, made in Japan. Japanese Godo tuners. Gorgeous. Go ahead and take a look at the neck pockets here. Yeah. Very nice, very nice. Beautiful guitar, guys. Killer value for the money, especially with this case. 
It is for sale. If you want to buy it, come on down to EssexRecordingStudios.com or Reverb.com. They host our site anyway. Uh, if you type in Ibanez RG1820X, 1820X, you're going to see this guitar up for sale. We ship and sell to any country in the world. We'll even smuggle it into North Korea. You can go blow it up in one of your bomb tests out there. No worries. We'll get it done. But, uh, yeah. So it is available. And if you want to record with this, I'm actually kind of excited because I really want to, I want to hear what this is all about. Then by all means, we are a recording studio. Get your butt down here and let's make some badass music together. How does that sound? Yeah? Cool. I'm out because I've got, a holiday to get ready for going to Greece, guys, and I have way too many videos to do for you. So let me go stick around on the channel. More coming up right after this. Later, dudes.